Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be making a fairy garden. I've seen this idea on various websites. I saw it on Pinterest, um, I've seen it on Facebook being shared, and I just thought it was the cutest thing. So what it is, is... So what it is, is you are supposed to buy little plants or like miniature trees like the bonsai trees and you're supposed to plant them in a small container and you can do various things. You can um, do little figurines and put them on there. You can add fairy light. So I got a couple of things that I thought would look really cute and I just wanted to try this and mine would be indoor. So I know that there's bigger ones that you can make on like barrels, which I thought was the coolest thing. but. I just feel like I should start with something smaller. So yeah, I just bought a couple of things that I thought would be cute. So yeah, let's just get started and see how it turns out. I'm excited. I wanted to show you what I got. I went to the store and I got various plants and I actually found these on clearance because um, I wanted to just to go really cheap for this. I didn't want to really spend a ton of money because I'm not sure how it's going to turn out or how long these plants are going to live. So. I just wanted to try out like the easiest possible option. So this is one of the plants and I thought it was really cute. It is kind of big um, for the uh, container, but I think it will do well. And I think there's actually two plants in here. I bought this little cactus. I thought it was the cutest thing and um, it could go perfectly because it's small. I bought this one that had little flowers and they're all different colors. So I thought it was really cute. Um, for like the little figurines that I was talking about, I went to Hobby Lobby and they had a ton. And the only thing that kind of disappointed me was that they were kind of pricey. Um, like they had stuff that was like even smaller than this that was like $5. And I just thought it would be like a buck. I found these little turtles and uh, frogs and then I found the little pots with flowers and I thought they were so cute. I found um, a fence because I want to do like a little fence around my little fairy house and um, for the fairy house I went to Walmart which is where I got the plants and I just found this little tiny birdhouse and it was blank. It was just like just wood color so I came home and I painted the birdhouse with some paints that I had so if you have paints you can definitely just paint your own um, little birdhouse or whatever you buy there's several options or you can just leave it blank I've seen that too so I had this little thing from um, a container that I had with a uh, plant and the plant died so I just thought it would be cute to add that. I don't know what it is. It's just like a little pumpkin I guess. I got some fairy lights and I bought these um, during Christmas because I do have another idea for a decoration and so I wanted to use these because I bought like six pack. I mean they literally were like 50 cents so I'm not sure what the price is for these or they have them in the same area because they had them where the uh, Christmas I was so you can just go and ask someone batteries for the fairy light and then the container and I'm doing a clear container because I want to Eventually move this into a basket. I've seen that idea I just kind of thought that the clear was better because there was just a lot of them that were Kind of bigger and, and they weren't the size that I wanted and so this was perfect and this is like 50 cents and then the last thing that you'll need is um potting soil. This is optional, but if you have a fish or something and you have rocks, like the aquarium rocks, you can do that or you can go outside and find some rocks. I've seen that too. Alright, so then I guess we can get started. I'm going to go ahead and move this down. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and start. So we got that open. We can go ahead and get the soil. I feel like this is going to be so messy. Alright, so then now that we have the soil in there, we're good to start adding the plants. I'm going to add this one. And this is the one that I think is 
really big, but I don't think it's too big. I mean, I could divide them. I think there, there's two plants in here. Let's see. Yeah. So I'm gonna just use one of them. All right, so now that I got the two plants, I think it looks really cute. I'm gonna figure out where I want the house. So go ahead and put it over here because I think this little corner is really cute. So it would look like this. So let me see. I could put it on that side and then maybe move this like this. Yeah, I think that looks good. Okay. Perfect. And then I'm going to put the house in here in the middle of those two. Let's see how it looks. So now that I got this, I'm gonna go ahead and start adding the accessories that I um, bought. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the fence. Oh, and it comes like this. So it's like several little ones. adorable I think this is so cute I'm gonna go ahead and start the um, adding the other accessories so I have the little frogs and the turtles so I'm gonna go ahead and add those over here so like one there one over here there we go and then one little frog here. And one there. Like that. Now what I want to do is add the rocks. Ah, how about that? So now that I have that, um, I have my little thing that I bought. So I'm just gonna put it maybe over here. There we go. Just this a little thing in the back. I think this is turning out really good. So the last thing we have is the fairy light. So for this one in particular, I'm gonna need three AA batteries. So I'm gonna go ahead and take those out. And I think you just turn them on. Yay, they're on. I'm gonna put them on the fence. I think that would be really cute. All right, so I added the little lights and I am really pleased. Like, I really like how this turned out. Just gotta play around with it, but it's perfect. All right, so the last um, finishing touches are these tiny little flowers that I found. They are so adorable adorable so I'm gonna go ahead and add them over here so I'm gonna put one on the entrance and then I'm gonna put the other one which is a pink one um, on the other side they're so tiny but oh my gosh look at that how adorable I finished the fairy garden and I am so happy with how it turned out it is just so adorable and I feel like it's going to be so easy to take care of it just because there's not a lot of plants and it's just so tiny. So I just think it was the best idea that I've had so far to make this video. I really enjoyed it and I just love going out and finding all these little accessories. So I think it was really fun. 
Alright everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please like it and subscribe. I will be making more videos like this. I have some other ideas in mind and I hope to see you next time. Bye!